Hi everyone, I'm Sincere Gonzalez. I'm a realtor in Port St. Lucie, Florida. I wanted to come on here because it's been a few months since I've been able to make a video. I wanted to say hello to my 750 subscribers. I can't even believe I have 750 subscribers. I was so excited to have 100. I can't even believe it. So I just want to say thank you to everybody uh, for, you know, the positive comments, for, you know, subscribing, for trusting me as your realtor, and for just everything i've been very grateful um i've been very very busy i you know the first few weeks of covid things were slow but then after that it has been extremely busy i have families always calling from new york city from california from massachusetts from miami from kind of like all over the place and um it's been really great uh, the market has kind of exploded what you could find for 250 in March is very different than when you can find for 250 right now it's changed um, because there's just so much activity in our area there's a lot of new construction if you're looking for new construction boy do I have places to take you so call me if um, you you know if you're looking for a new house whether you want to be in an HOA or not an HOA or a retirement community I have new construction for just about every budget and every situation. It's fantastic. A lot of times, you know, you'll I'll take a client out to see 10 homes, 10 resale homes, and when they see new construction, they're like, no, it doesn't even make sense to buy an old house if I can just build one for just about the same amount of money. And, you know, you have all these warranties from the builder. You have a brand new house. You have pretty much zero to worry about for a really long time when you buy new construction. Anyway, also pool homes have become harder to come by. Whenever there is a pool home on the market, they kind of like, it's very competitive and very hard. Uh, a lot of people, you know, there's multiple offer situations for pool homes and for a lot of other homes that are priced right. But anyway, uh, the best way to get a hold of me these days, since my phone rings a lot, is to text me with your name, your last name, your email address, what kind of house you're looking for, and when you plan to be in the area. Then in response, I'm going to send you an email with a whole bunch of information about our area, and I'm going to suggest some local lenders that can help you uh, with getting pre-approved for a loan. All right, um, I wanted to talk about, uh, is Port St. Lucie a place for old people? Hmm. I've had that question asked a lot and you know when people are considering a place like Port St. Lucie they'll go on the internet and they'll do some research and then they might go on a website and see a remark like oh Port St. Lucie is for old people and yeah we have a lot of retirement communities in Port St. Lucie and it can be a great place to retire but it's not necessarily for you know retirement only I would say Port St. Lucie is 60% young families and 40 percent retirement communities so there's a good balance of people um it's definitely not only for retirement and there's a you know it's not miami dade which is where i grew up it's not you know broward county it's it's not any of these huge metropolitan places but there's a lot of fun things to do and there's a lot of great restaurants and you know more coming every day port st has grown so much and it's not stopping anytime soon it's really just great the more i show property and the more i make these videos for instagram and for youtube the more i appreciate where i live i really really love it here um yeah so just if you're looking for a list of things to do or restaurants or anything like that text me and i'll send that list to you it's it's really a nice place to be all right so there's been that debate lately i've had a lot of people ask me about the east coast of florida versus the west coast of florida that's going to come down to your preference i did a lot of research when i moved here from miami um i wanted to be close to miami i wanted to be on the east coast because it's just younger it's hipper and it was closer to my family and for me the east coast wins every time and then what we do as a family is that we vacation on the west coast of florida it's a three hour drive pretty much to anywhere you go on the west coast um we like to go to sanibel island sarasota siesta key those are just great places to get away you know from the hustle and bustle from the east coast where you live you go and you vacation there and then you come back it's very convenient for me i like the east coast better that's just going to be up to each person of course um so what has been happening a lot lately is that prices have gone up pretty dramatically but at the end of the day when FHA buyers 
it's time to appraise the home and the homes are not appraising for the price that they are contracted to sell okay and that is very good news for the buyer because if you're an fha buyer and the house appraises lower then they pretty much have to sell you the house at that price because that appraisal stays with that house for six months so i mean i i don't know technically if they're forced to sell it to you but at that point it it just doesn't even make sense to like hold on to the house for six months until that appraisal goes away and then have another person come and buy it um it's been happening a lot i've had three back to back that haven't appraised and the price has come in lower for the appraisal and they've had to sell it to them for the appraised value which is great news for buyers my buyers have all been very happy because they've ended up getting their homes for significantly less than they were planning to okay so what does that mean for sellers if you're planning on selling it's a really good time to sell because houses are flying off the market and as long as your realtor is doing their job running the comparables the way an appraiser would being very careful about the price that they tell you about the expectation of price that they give you that they tell you that the house can sell for then if you have a realistic expectation of what it can really sell for you're great i mean it's a great time to sell things are just selling very very fast so um that's kind of what i wanted to talk about today i'm excited to i have a lot of plans of videos that i'm going to be making we have a website that i have previewed already um www.homesearchpsl.com it is a beautiful website and it is super functional it is i think comparable to zillow and realtor.com and i think that you guys are going to enjoy doing your own home searches on this website it's got like a whole bunch of like my favorite amazing communities um, it's got a list for pool homes, it's got filters, it's got a map, it's great. And I can't wait for all of you guys to um, check it out. I'll make an announcement here on YouTube when it's ready and live. I think that'll be tomorrow. Um, but I can't wait to hear what you guys think about the website and let me know if it's uh, functional, if you find it easy to work with. And what is great about it is that when you save the homes and you put little hearts on them, it tells me on my end what you're what you're saving so that way um, when you're ready to buy a house i can go in there and see what you've already saved and just make those appointments for you which is great um yep so that's pretty much all i have to talk about today i want to say thank you 750 subscribers on youtube whoop, whoop. i'm very thankful for that thank you to everybody for trusting in me as your realtor and for subscribing to this channel i really appreciate it if you like this video please give it a thumbs up i will be taking my gopro with me on my future showings it's been really kind of hard because i've been so busy that sometimes i forget to even charge the camera to when i you know when i go show property but i'll i promise to bring it along and show you what is out there and also have just a lot of plans of uh, information that i want to get out to you about port st Lucie. so remember the best way to reach me is to text me at 772 200 9112 text me your name your last name your email what kind of house you're looking for when you plan to move to the area and in reply i'm going to send you an, a lot of information that i think you will enjoy and then we'll start uh being in contact and eventually we'll get on the phone we'll have a long conversation 